Welcome on Travels Code channel. In this video, I will show you how to install Elasticsearch on your Windows computer. We will use Windows 10. So let's start. First of all, let's open browser. And uh, Google install Elasticsearch. Then we go to the first link. It's official elastic.com.com site and uh, we need to download MSI file package. So here as you see we have download MSI package and uh, it's for the current version. So let's save this file. So as you see it's current version 7.9 and we will install this one and after that we can follow this guide and do everything step by step. File was downloaded and let's go to downloads, click this one and we will install this file. So we will use default directories, it's directory for data for configuration and for logs. So let's choose this one. Then we will install it as a service. It will be automatically started when computer is started and uh, shut down when we will turn off our windows. And it will be automatically started when, down, when installation is complete. So let's use by default everything. Then we need to uh, configure with the port. Use default port. It's default Elasticsearch port, so do not change it. But in case you need to change it for some security reasons, you can do it. But in general, do not change it. So cluster name will be default. Roles, it has all roles and the memory we will provide two or what we can do, three. Let's do 2.5 and uh, click next. So. Here we see that we can install some additional plugins. So right now we won't choose anyone, but if you need something, something specific, you can choose. For example, S3 for saving your data, snapshot of your data on AWS S3. But we will choose next and license. We have two options, is basic or trial. Trial will allow us to use all XPEC features but only 30 days. So as you see we will have machine learning, graph, alerting and security and a lot of other. But in case of basic we will have all three X pack basic features. In our case we will use basic and let's install it. So don't forget allow installation, let's click yes and uh, as you see installation process is running. Ok, we have successfully installed Elasticsearch, you can open some documentation or Elasticsearch in browser. So let's open it. So as you see we need put login and password for authorization and uh, by default it should be empty but anyway we see this error. Now when we installed Elasticsearch we need generate password for our default user. So. Let's go to Elasticsearch folder. Program files, Elastic, Elasticsearch version and uh, bin. Let's copy this path. Then in common prompt, let's go. Here we need to type the next command.
with auto key passwords so then we need to confirm this operation and randomly will be generated passwords for our users so in the end we have elastic user and this password let's copy this password and open elastic search localhost so we need type elastic user and this password And so, as you see, it was installed, Elasticsearch works, and uh, this is easy way how to install Elasticsearch. So, subscribe my YouTube channel to see more useful videos how to use web technologies.